Well, this is a very last minute video or surprise video because right there is a bear. We are on the Norquay Road just outside of Banff going up. Looks like a grizzly from the back, but in fact, we don't think so. The large hindquarter curved front, that is a cinnamon black bear. Looking back, and uh, he, and I'm going to say he because it looks like a young male, uh, but has all the features, very healthy animal, beautiful coat. We were just driving up, plotting out a live virtual tour. Thought we'd go up and see if there were some other animals about. And there is a beautiful bear sighting. We are only a couple of kilometers from the town site of Banff. But uh, black bears are distinguished. Again, see how the fur is not black, per se. He is just eating flowers, having a lovely time. No distinctive hump over the shoulders. And therefore, that's usually the most obvious giveaway with the grizzly. Uh, if you stop the video at some point and scan in, you will see short, curved claws. Now, they're not truly retractable. It's often said about black bears. Not true. But they're designed for climbing trees, whereas the grizzlies are much, much longer and more distinct. There's the long nose. Uh, they function as much by smell and those lovely sort of teddy bear ears, which of course are endemic to them. I did say to Finn he could step out and lift the tail just to check the gender. <laughs> but no, Finn... My son is holding the camera and doing an excellent job. Again, we didn't have anything set up, but it's just so wonderful to encounter wildlife. And there the bear is moving away. Of course, we would never leave the car. We are doing everything as respectfully to wildlife as possible. Uh, in fact, our first clue to an animal was a cyclist who was stopped in the middle of the road and had uh, his camera out. And uh, so there it goes. There's a chance to look at the legs. So this is quite a steep hill. There's several bends. It's an average 6% gradient for about 6 kilometers or so from the valley floor up to the base of the ski area at Mount Norquay. So this was the first ski area in the Banff region. Uh, it's the smallest resort, but still really good and fun. But in the summertime, we like to cycle up this road. Say average 6% grade. Good exercise. Look at that fabulous blue sky that is so famous in Alberta. But we just thought, seeing as how we saw the bear, we'll curve around a couple of bends. But a very important sign coming up out in front of us saying, do not throw food out of the window. That's self-evident, but it's actually showing an apple core. So even organic food that would be absorbed into the system can therefore condition animals like bears to associate people with food. Should that happen, the bear becomes known as a spoiled bear. And eventually, if the bear then attacks humans, it leads to the bear's destruction. So it's an important thought. Uh, additional to that, on the side of this mountain, there are often, well, deer everywhere, both mule deer and white-tailed deer, and beautiful Rocky Mountain bighorn sheep, as well as golfers and pikas and birds everywhere. But there is a late springtime bear sighting. Again, probably a young male, but hard to say. So thank you. Please subscribe and give us a thumbs up. Thank you. See you soon.